In 2011, I was diagnosed with congestive heart failure. Growing up, I was always really healthy. I had no idea anything was going on. So I went to the doctor and they took chest x-rays and, and found out that my heart was enlarged. Nobody can prepare you for when you get that phone call and all those emotions that come through, but you're just thankful that it's happening, I guess. They take you down and, you know, it's like, that could be the last time you see your kids. Well, I mean, it's scary for anybody, you know. You never know when it's gonna happen, but, you know, it's just scary. All the nurses were awesome, doctors were awesome. They prepared me very, very well. I mean, they go over, you know, everything as far as you know, financially and medications and everything you should expect before and after. It's weird when you weren't really an emotional person before transplant and then all of a sudden everything becomes that much more special, I guess, to you. It's because you're still here to see it. I can't imagine not being around. I mean, just when my daughter went to kindergarten that first day, that was emotional just to be able to see that. I feel funny, I can call it any time, or, I mean, everything's just been great. I mean, I haven't had any issue with getting in contact with anybody. If I have to leave a voicemail, they get right back to me immediately. Thank you, most of all. Um, everything's been a really great experience.